Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be doing a clean and decorate with me for fall. Mama is tired, but I need to kick some butt today. So, like I said, we're gonna be doing a fall decorate and clean with me. My house is a hot mess, as you can see behind me. I just put the kids down for a nap in their room, so they are both sleeping or at least having some quiet time. So I figured this would be a good time for me to clean the house and to get on the ball for fall. <laughs> All right, you guys, I hope you enjoy this fall decorate and clean with me, and let's hop right into it. All right, guys, I am starting off by showing you one of the wreaths that I handmade. This was all made from things from Hobby Lobby. I will do a DIY on it one of these days, but it's one of my most favorite things to do for each season is make a new holiday wreath. I'm gonna pause it there for a second. Kaya just woke up, or not woke up, but she was just like resting in her room. Okay, so the reason why I wanted to pause there is because I wanted to show you guys that I separate out my fall and Halloween decorations. I will store all of it together um, just for space sakes, um, but I will typically start my fall slash autumn decorations right around back to school time. So that's right around August 25th here. This year I'm getting my decorations up even earlier because I love fall. But I'm starting early this year for you guys. I wanted to get this out a little bit early this year though because I wanna give you guys plenty of time to come up with some of your own ideas. Hopefully this will inspire you and give you some ideas um, based off of what I do and how to kind of coordinate things. I'll likely be adding as I go. I always love to go fall decor shopping. In fact, I've got a fall decor home goods shop with me coming at you guys probably sometime next week um, to kind of show you what's in the stores this year. Hobby Lobby, home goods, those are my two go-tos for um, decorations and then sometimes TJ Maxx I can really find some cute stuff too so anyways I just wanted to pause tell you guys how I separate out my decorations eventually I will have all of it out together um, but this is the pile that I start with it doesn't look like much but trust me you guys it's a lot time to start putting some pumpkins in place <laughs> should we put those up here. Yeah, we can't keep, we're gonna put it up.
I wanted to show you guys this side so far. I've kind of been playing with it. Um, I don't want to take my cactuses down, I don't think. Um, but this side definitely needs something in here. So I will probably be going to Home Goods and finding something to go in here. Um, so when I do that fall decor shop with me at Home Goods later this week, I'll take you with me and um, like show you what I find for that little area because over on the other side, this is nice, it's filled out, it's a little bit simpler. Um, I still have to f finish putting some of this stuff up up here, but definitely just need something, I feel like something round, something maybe woody and round, I'm not totally sure, um, but that is what I'm thinking for right here.
this area just real quick. So this is mass chaos, even though I just cleaned it. Um, but next month we are going to be putting in a media center here um, with sliding doors because we make those on the side as part of our business. And then we're going to be doing built-in um, like cubbies here, maybe with cabinets over them. I'm not totally sure, but we're gonna do that on either side. And then it's gonna have lots of storage for like all the kids' toys and diapers and wipes, like board games. And then Riker's swing. We're not gonna build those until Riker's fully out of his swing, um, just because the swing fits perfectly right here. Sorry, I've got like dog toys spread underneath. As soon as I like put them away, they're all taken out again. Same with all the kid toys. But um, that is the plan for this area. And then I have been talking on my Instagram for a while now that I was gonna wait and do a dining room reveal for you guys when it was completely done. But um, our dining room table won't be done until September. And then um, back here, we've got lots of things planned for on either side of this, this entire wall the backsplash, we've got lots of plans for this area. Um, like I said, new dining table, all new chairs to go around. It's going to be quite the makeover. Um, but I did get this rug and this shelf in, so you guys can kind of have a sneak peek for like what the dining room's gonna look like. But stay tuned for that because it's going to be incredible, and we're gonna have DIYs for um, everything that we're doing. So like. DIY ship lap, we've got a DIY table because we do make dining tables on the side um, as part of our business as well. So stay tuned, it's gonna be super fun. Okay guys, that is going to wrap it up for today's video. I hope you enjoyed this fall decorate and clean with me. This is just a part one to this fall series. I will have more fall decorate videos coming up for you. Um, like I mentioned a couple of times, I will be doing a home goods shop um, fall decor with me more than likely a TJ Maxx and a Hobby Lobby as well because there are additional pieces that I'm looking for this year just to kind of fill out my area some more. And then as we get those furniture pieces in place in the living rooms, the media center, I will need more fall stuff for on there. So, um, and then I've got some like things in mind for upstairs too. I'm just really trying to finish out the house this year. Um, we built our house, so it's just kind of builder grade and I'm trying to put in um, just a little bit more character. I've switched out some light fixtures, things like that, but lots of stuff to come, so stay tuned. Again, thank you so much for tuning in to today's video. If you guys like this kind of video on my channel and you enjoy the DIY makeover series type of videos and decorate videos, please give it a big thumbs up. Leave a comment down below with what kind of home makeover series video you would like to see. Make sure you're subscribed so you don't miss out on any of my other future videos. We do have a really fun vacation coming up to California. Stay tuned for that. But I will see you guys on Tuesday for a day in the life. Okay, bye guys.